hello guys in this video I'm going to show you how to load database table values in data grid view or how to populate data grid view from data table in vb.net so if we click this button we're going to get uh, this data grid view populated by the MySQL database values okay so let's get started so in order to populate the data grid view from MySQL database <coughs> first of all I'm going to take a data grid view and a button So to populate the data grid view from data table, I will write the code in this button. So I'm double clicking on the button. Now here I'm going to add the code. Dim str as string equal data source the connection string okay so basically the connection string everyone is going to have a different connection string if you want to know how to get this connection string i have already made a separate video on this topic so i will put the link in the description you can check that out next line <clears throat> next line dim con as new sql connection the string variable okay so sql connection is this red underline because we have not imported so I have imported this system.data.sql client. Now next line. Dim com I am taking com. The earlier one was con as string equal my query. select star from my table name okay this is my table all right this is my table here so let's continue with our query here post table order by date ascending next dim adapter We're going to take a variable for adapter as new SQL data adapter okay then we are going to enter com comma call next dim we are going to take data set variable as dss new data set next adapter 
dot fill ds comma post table post table is my table name by the way then data grid view data grid view one dot data source equal to data set dot tables zero okay now data grid view dot show That's it guys, thank you for watching.